Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to download VLC Player for your Mac for free. So first of all, just open up Safari, Google Chrome or Firefox and you're going to just search for VLC Player. So just type it up and on Google your first, very first thing will say VideoLand and just click there. And from here it's going to tell you for Mac. So you should detect that you have a Mac. It's free. You can make a donation, which I suggest because VLC player is really good. Or you can make the um, payment later if you like. And only if you want to, it's a donation. You don't have to. Anyways, from here you just click on download VLC. And there you just have to wait a little bit. Um, now, the dun downloading time does depend on your internet speed. So sometimes it will be faster and sometimes it will be a little bit slower. In this case, it's going to take up an average amount of time which is 10 seconds um, so we're just gonna wait for that to be done and then we just have to double click to install the VLC player so we're just waiting for it to download and there we go okay so from here we can just double click right here or we can just open it up in our downloads folder so right now we're just gonna do it right from here just double click on it it's gonna open up, it's uh, DMG files, every single program that's for Mac has to be DMG or they might be packaged as well. Um, at this point what you guys can do is just drag this BLC, okay right here into folders, okay into applications or you can open up your finder window, open up applications and drag it there. It's the same thing, we're just gonna drag it right here, so just drag on top of it and there's your BLC plan. So that's pretty much the installation for any program with Mac, unless they're packaged files where they kind of do another type of thing, but um, it's all about just double clicking on those packaged files. For these ones, you just drag them. And most applications that you will see, you just have to drag them into your applications folder. From there, we can just open it up. And something that you will see is that message. You might get it once or twice and that's it. Um, you want uh, you probably guys don't want this so no thanks for now and that's it VLC player so VLC player as you know is really good it can play almost any type of file out there so that's why I really suggest um, something I also suggest doing is just checking for updates so just go up to here click on check for update and check out if you have the most current version that's it for this tutorial if you guys have any questions comments you can write them below and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you